A 220-acre campus on the banks of the Taunton River, Bristol Aggie prepares competent, passionate, and engaged students for today's expanding global landscape. For over 100 years, students have graduated from this elite institution, their post-secondary aspirations and keen sense of purpose shaping the direction of their educational experience. With seven agricultural majors to choose from and rigorous academics, Bristol Aggie provides the perfect balance in education. Welcome to Bristol County Agricultural High School. As a student at Bristol Aggie, you can expect to be an active participant in your education. In both academic and agricultural vocational courses, the content is rigorous and relevant. Students will be challenged to apply what they learn in the classroom to practical, authentic situations. It's not just about what you know, but your ability to use that knowledge in actual scenarios. The college-like campus offers students an unparalleled sense of independence and level of responsibility. One of the crown jewels that makes Bristol Aggie Bristol Aggie is that we are a small school. Um, you know, you're not just a number. You know, I always say, here you actually get to know the students, you get to know the families, you get to know everybody involved. Um, you know, it definitely, it, it, it truly supports the, you know, the adage, it takes a village to raise a child because we definitely work with students, parents, members of the community to really know and understand and support the child to become successful in four years. Uh, and not only in four years, but you know, every day we want them to be successful. Uh, we're doing a lot of work now, really looking at the future of agriculture. We have uh, a new program that's starting uh, known as Aggie Air, where we're launching drones uh, to help us with uh, data uh, and looking at future trends for agriculture, whether it's forestry patterns or migration patterns of birds, uh, we can use the drones to check on soil um, and with infrared, so there are a lot of different applications. We're definitely looking at uh, ways to um, you know, bring agriculture into the 21st century. Our teachers here uh, are so invested in the students. They are here early, they stay late, um, and it is truly uh, what that student needs, uh, not just um, you know, bell to bell or 8 to 2.30, it's, it, they're truly invested in the students to make sure that they're as successful as they could possibly be. I believe students love it here because it's something different. They know that they can invest in their future and the people around them are very invested in their future, always striving as leaders to be our best, as role models to do our best to help the students to succeed in life. I was a small animal science major, and I now go to the University of Massachusetts Amherst, where I'm a double major in biochemistry and molecular biology, and psychology with a concentration in neuroscience. Keep your mind open to the, all the different possibilities that there are at Aggie, and really connect with people, and figure out what you want to do, because this is such a period of growth. You have four years here, and only four years, to really learn what you want to do before you go to college. So really enjoy it, keep your mind open to all the different possibilities, and make sure you connect with your teachers because they're one of the best aspects of Bristol Aggie. Probably the best part of Bristol Aggie was the community that we had here. Um, coming from a really small elementary school where everything was, you had your group and you had your set, set of friends and like no one came out of that. When I came to Bristol Aggie, I had no one here. And I think coming to Bristol Aggie was probably the best experience I've ever had. Everyone is so welcoming, all the teachers, all the staff. It's 
So going into Freshman Academy as a freshman, I wasn't like nervous per se, but I was on the verge of like, I'm excited, I'm nervous, I'm excited, wait, I'm still nervous, kind of feelings that you get, like butterflies in your stomach, and you walk into this room and you'll have all these seats set up around the gym, and you have to pick a seat. But this seat could determine who your friends are for the rest of your high school career. So you're freaking out, you're like, oh no, what if I sit next to the wrong person, what if they don't like me? Bristol Aggie is such a family, it doesn't matter where you sit down on that first day of freshman orientation. So as a junior in high school at Bristol Aggie, I actually got to show uh, some skill sets to veterinary students, people six, seven years into their post-secondary education, skill sets that they had never seen, one of them being flipping a sheep. Some of these veterinary students actually fell over themselves trying to do these skills that I, a junior in high school, knew how to do proficiently. Taking animal nutrition at a college level was such a review after taking it at Bristol Aggie. I actually used my high school notes from the instructor to study for a college level animal nutrition exam and actually did very well using this instructor's notes. It truly prepares you and it, although the classes have seemed very hard at the high school level, uh, it makes them so much better when you take them at the college level. It doesn't matter what type of day I'm having, the minute I step foot on this campus, it changes. And the scenery is gorgeous, no question about it. This is a beautiful campus, sitting on the Taunton River. You couldn't get a more beautiful place to go to school or go to work. But it's not that that puts the smile on my face, it's the students. They are welcoming to new students and they're welcoming to new staff, they're welcoming to new adults. They understand what this community is all about and they're such willing participants in this. I think we're at this very exciting crossroads right now with Bristol Aggie. It's already such a, a stimulating environment for students. It affords them opportunities that they would never get anywhere else. And you talk about college and career readiness. These kids leave here and they are miles ahead of other people their age entering into college, entering into the workforce. And in part, that's because we have what's called an advisory. We have people in industry constantly telling our department heads what's going on, what's the latest and greatest in all of uh, their industries. But then to add to that, we have this huge building project about to start. The MSBA has signed off on a $103 million science and environmental science and animal sciences building. And that's very exciting because we're now going to be able to take what we do so well already and go even the next step.